The reactors in Units 1 to 3 of the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant were severely damaged when their cooling system shut down after a tsunami struck the plant in 2011. As a result, the fuel rods inside melted and fell to the bottom of the reactor. Removal of this melted fuel is a crucial part of the plant's decommissioning and a key requirement is to locate the debris inside the reactor. So far, many attempts have been made to understand conditions inside the reactor, but the radiation level is too high for human beings to go inside. To address the issue, TEPCO will use a technology that employs muon cosmic ray particles to capture an image of the reactor's interior. Muons are subatomic particles that can penetrate most objects easily, but are blocked by heavy substances like concrete and uranium. It is believed that these particles can be used to see inside the reactor, much like an X-ray. A muon detection device was set up next to the Unit 1 reactor to test the technology for the first time. The device converts muons into electric signals for collection as image data after passing through the reactors. An analysis of the findings is scheduled to be completed by the end of March. We are planning a second test at Unit 2 in the near future using another method of muon technology and we will continue to collaborate with domestic and international experts to determine what is happening inside the reactor core.